Photoshop integrates with Adobe XD seamlessly. All you need to do is save the PSD. Then just launch Adobe XD, locate that PSD file, and select Open. Also, if you're on a Mac, you can right-click and select XD from the flyout menu. Notice how all the layers come in. You can see what was once a clipping mask is also a mask in Adobe XD. Uh, we can change the vertical height of this artboard. So when you do preview it, the screen size is smaller and you can scroll to the rest of that content. Another thing you can do is select any element and check fixed position and you can see it will, it will stay right in position. You can also duplicate artboards in Adobe XD and change around that content any way you want or really create anything that you want directly in Adobe XD. From there, we can dive into prototyping, and it really enables us to link any artboards we want together using really any element, such as this button here, and link it to this secondary artboard, in this case, have it slide left, and then even selecting this back button and pointing it back to that first screen and having it slide right. So you can add transitions, uh, link any uh, artboards together that you want, to make a prototype. But we can also go beyond that because I'm gonna make a new screen. This is just gonna be an overlay because I want to bring in a keyboard from a UI kit. And when you select a text field, in this case an email field, it will actually overlay that new keyboard and it's going to slide it up. So implementing that overlay, we can click to that secondary screen and you can see that overlay work as expected. Adobe XD works seamlessly with Photoshop to get you up and running quickly.